Many developers have tried, but this is the latest incarnation of what could be coming to the Intercoastal Waterway, all part of Gulf Shores Waterway District. Dirt is already being moved and a marina is starting to form along the north bank of the Intercoastal Waterway in Gulf Shores. That's the one thing we've missed for, since the beginning of Gulf Shores is having some opportunity for water access in a boat. Uh, we don't have, we have very little of that. One, two, three, go! With the groundbreaking Friday of a development called Waterway Village West, that could change and bring so much more. We're a lifestyle, all service oriented type developer. The first phase, called the Town Center, will have outdoor venues, multi-use trails, restaurants, retail shops, and hotels, but will begin with a state-of-the-art marina. I think we'll have the wet marina open for next season, uh, for sure. The docks are already here, and they're ready to be installed. Um, the, uh, the dry storage building will probably be 15 months from now before it opens. The property sits off County Road 4 West, the building where the announcement was made, left from a failed attempt to develop the same property. But Mayor Kraft expects this time will be different. We have had a lot of efforts here, and none of which I believe were as well founded as this one. Not just founded, but funded. Lulu's, Tacky Jack's, Acme Oyster House already have a place here on the ICW. They may be getting neighbors soon. The mayor says he expects five more announcements, just like this one in the very near future. On the Baldwin County Beating Gulf Shores, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.